What's up, YouTube? It's me, Super Mario DJ here, and welcome back to another video. To, uh, you know, today, tonight, whenever you're watching the video. Yes, I know I'm using the live stream setup instead of you know just uh, using this default screen, but I felt like I wanted to have my face for this uh, one, so I'm still working on a face uh, cam with the uh, just video recording setup. So I'll figure that out eventually. But anyways, that's not important. So. Um, I know it's first and foremost, uh, I know it's been a couple of, uh, days since I last, you know, did a couple of videos and streams, like, I know I had the FNAF semi-vlog, and then we had a Minecraft for You video, but yeah, I'm still working on some content, I'm preparing a few things for this week that are gonna be fun, and I hope you guys are excited for, uh, and, um, <clears throat> basically I wanna give context behind this video before we hop right into the, you know, the meat of it. So basically, like I said, preparing stuff, I'm getting, you know, screenshots and whatnot, and making thumbnails, and, you know, preparing game captures, and make sure games are playable and not lagging and whatnot. And, well, <clears throat> let's just say, as I was setting up a certain stream, and was trying out something that was gonna, I was gonna have a whole fun, like, hour and a half stream on, ended up hitting a, a funky roadblock, where, like, I was trying to work out the problem, where, like, part of the thing I wanted to do was working, but not the other half, and it's, like, I was trying to work around it for a couple days, and it's just, like, not getting anywhere with it, so I thought, well, one of the things is working, so why not make a small video as a bonus, uh, for this little, like, mini-series that is, like, that is every so often on the channel, and then come back to it with a, another stream on a different, like, topic for that stream, thumbnail, and whatnot, so, <clears throat> yeah. That's the point. Anyways, I've been beating around the bush for about two minutes already with uh, this intro. So, <clears throat> basically, I'm talking about Bloody Basics Classic, not Plus, but I'm talking about Bloody Basics Classic. Um, <clears throat> if you are, you know, not aware, Bloody Basics Classic is a, you know, the original is a, like, an indie game. You know, we've been covering it. It's like a horror ma uh, edu education parody game, and... We've been playing it, and it's just been every so often. We've been playing it, you know, last episode was about a month ago, and then, you know, it's just been here and there on the uh, channel. If, you know, YouTube would load. But yeah, if you just search, and even if, even if you just search Baldi's uh, basics on the channel, <clears throat> you'll find a random test thing from, like, a couple of years ago. Which is irrelevant. And I even find this old video that probably should be unlisted at this point. But I just haven't done that. But yeah. Basically back in. Uh, j basically almost a year ago. Back in June of uh, this year. Uh, last year. Not this year. I just booted up all these basic classic again. Just to be funny. For a reason that ex is explained in that stream thumbnail. In that stream thumbnail. In the description. God I'm getting my words mixed up tonight. I am. <clears throat> apologize. But yeah. Basically, after I did that, I started making a series, you know, just trying to get through the game, because I actually got surprisingly far, which I wasn't planning to. And, you know, we had some, you know, we actually did some endless mode and whatnot, but yeah. Basically, it's just like, we've been doing this every now and then, and I've been trying to beat the game, but, um, <clears throat> we still have yet to do that. And I was just trying to maybe do that before I played Baldi's Basics Plus, but that might change depending on the next streams, but we'll see. But anyways... <clears throat> So I had remembered, since I had updated to 1.4.3, that I had remembered there might have been, like, you know, something uh, you could do with the uh, the new ThinkPad that was in that version. And, like, I remember, like, kind of codes you could type in for, like, the answers, and it would take you to certain areas, or it would do certain things to the game play. And it's like, I wanted to do that as a stream, but um, one of the things, I found a video which was rem ha helped remind me about what I was trying to find, and I won't play it or whatnot. But I it was saying for 1.4.3, but one of the one of the two codes was not working when I was playing the game for myself off camera, and well I then found out as this title suggests it was only for 1.4.1, so that version is not on, you know, uh, <clears throat> game built anymore. So it's like I can't even do one of the secrets, and that was like the bigger of the two secrets. So I'm like, well. Might as well just do a video on the one secret that I know is uh, playable and just cover it. So, yeah, don't know why that opened. But, yeah, anyways, that's enough rambling. That's enough context. I'll maybe put a couple timestamps, but I don't even know if it would work with the chapter features. But, yeah, basically, that's the rambling out of the way. Let's just actually start Baldi's Basics uh, Classic. 
and let's just show you what I've been, uh, what I was going to do for a stream. But now I'm doing as a small video. So, yeah. <clears throat> Here we go. Going to get game capture ready to go. Five minutes in. This might even be like a, a short video. Like I said, I don't, I'm not expecting this to be long because this secret is not as big as the second one that I was going to, like I said, mainly focus the stream on. But it is what it is. So, let's just get game capture going. It is loaded. <clears throat> and, um, yeah. <clears throat> Warning in, case, warning, in case you haven't figured out yet, this game is, not, is intended to be a horror game as such. You know, there might be some things that scare the player. The game is pretty generically spoopy. And, and, well, if you downloaded this for educational purpose, well, you should probably not let your kids play it unless they actually like horror games. But we're going to press a key. <coughs> press a key. And here's the iconic music. Welcome to Basics in Education and Learning. <coughs> like I said, 1.4.3. And we're just going to start a normal game. I might also test this out to see if this works in endless mode, but yeah. Basically, <clears throat> we're going to load the game, we're going to start playing the game normally, and when we get to the impossible problem, I'm going to enter certain numbers in, and you'll see. Hello, Baldy, it's been a little bit. I'm just going to look around, it's been a little bit, Baldy. You need to collect two notebooks before you can use these doors. Yeah. There's, that doesn't happen to that. That doesn't happen to that door. You need to collect two notebooks before you can use these doors. Yeah, maybe if I get it. All right, let's just go get our notebooks. Let's just go get our notebooks. Now it's time for four minus eight, eight subject, negative math. four. Answer the three questions correctly, and you might get something special. Yeah. Just type the correct answer into the empty box. Yeah. Press the enter key on your keyboard when you think you have the right answer. Yep. Problem one. Great job. That's right. Uh -huh. And two. this one is negative five. You are doing fantastic. Don't know what's up with the Great negative job. numbers, but apparently Baldi likes That's negative right. numbers today. That one was all negative numbers. Apparently Baldi was in the mood for negative numbers. Come here and get your prize. A shiny quarter. Thank you for my quarter. Just click on it. The left mouse button to your left. Yep. Something you can use it on. Right click on the object. Yep. And the selected. That's how you use items, you know. I'm glad I can hear you through the wall, Baldi. Oh, look at more negative numbers. Wait, no, no, it's not negative number. I was going to say, oh, look, more negative numbers. But it isn't more negative numbers. It's a positive numbers. Problem three. Plus. Times. Now I'm gonna enter this specific number code into the into the pad. Three one seven one eight. And it says we got it wrong, but we're not in the schoolhouse anymore. We are in an interesting place and I can't really turn my mouse around. I can only go forward, back, you know, I can walk through walls. There's these random heads staring at me menacingly. Yeah, I'm definitely not in the schoolhouse. I'm. Did I, did I beat? Did I win? Did I beat the game? No, I didn't. It's an Easter egg room, and I literally am gonna have to like shut down the game to restart the game. So I, I, I can't even hit escape. Press escape and have the, you know, the. Would you like the quick game pop up? I am just stuck in here until I decide to close the game. So I'm stuck in here with all these random heads. I can't even, like I said, I can barely turn the mouse. All these heads are just staring at me menacingly. It's only two of them. I don't know why. I can't walk through. Wait, I can't walk through this one. I walked through the other one. Can I not? Can I not walk through it? I can't. I can't walk through the walls anymore. I walked through the walls, but okay, I, I walked through that one. Are you telling me I can't walk through this one? Alrighty then. You can only walk through this one on a certain, you know, side. All right, I don't know why I don't know who why these random faces are staring at me. The baldy with hair, I don't know what these are. But yeah, this was gonna be one of the things in the in the stream. And the second thing I said, it, it had something to do with kind of like kind of inverting the screen to be upside down, and we we're gonna probably be sticking to the ceiling as the Easter egg. I'm pretty sure it was called, but um, we're not. We can't do that because I needed to be on one point uh, one point four point one and um. That's not the one I'm playing right now. I'm playing 1.4.3. So the previous video that I found this code in the original code in for the other Easter egg, 
is either not working for me, or like I said, the video kind of had misinformation, and it just didn't work. So yeah, this is what I was going to do. So, yeah, now I'm just going to, you know, I'm just going to, you know, close the game. And I am going, oh, I said I'm going to close the game. I misclicked, I misclicked the closing icon. I'm going to close the game. And we're going to open it again to see if we can do this in endless mode. And then that's going to be the video. So, yeah. I just want to see if it's possible in endless mode because I haven't tested it in endless mode. So, we're going to try this in endless mode. If I can close this folder. I can't close this. Okay, I can't close the game folder. Endless mode. Welcome to Baldwin's Basics in Education and Learning. That's me. And we're also gonna see if we can just do it. And we're also gonna see if we can just do it on any and on any problem, like the first problem. Everybody's favorite subject, math. Yep, you can do it. On any, you can do it on any problem and in endless mode. It just takes us back here. So yeah. Um. Well, it was nice seeing whoever you guys are. I'm just kind of you know kind of stuck here in Baldi's purgatory or whatever this thing is. Like I said. It sure was interesting, and like I said, it was going to be made into a stream with another thing that, like I said, I couldn't get working in 1.4.3. So, yeah. If you guys, uh, I can get, I can show you a notepad where I wrote down the codes, and then if you guys want to let me know in the comment section if you think it is possible to make the code work in this version, or if it's, like I said, it is just for 1.4.1, uh, 1 .1, then you can let me know, but yeah. That's uh that's the Easter egg for now. I don't think I want to come back here for a a good while, but yeah, that's uh that's the that is the Easter egg. That is the lovely Easter egg that uh greets us in Baldi's if we so choose to enter those numbers into the ThinkPad. You can ThinkPad, so yeah. Let's just close the game. <clears throat> close the folder. And like I said, wrap up the video. Let me just show you this notepad that I had taken down for, like I said, for the stream. That is now just this small video. But yeah, like I said, we typed this one in. And this was supposed to be the code that activated, like I said, things to go upside down. And that was going to be, like, the majority of the game. Because, like, you can actually play the main game being upside down. And that was going to be, like, the main mess around. I definitely probably was not going to beat the game with the game upside down. But I wanted to try it out. And, well, I'm not going to unless I can, you know, either it, someone in the comments section help me figure out how to type this in in 1.4.0. Three or if it's just a 1.4.1 thing. So yeah, that's the video for tonight. Uh, I hope you have enjoyed. Uh, again, it's a little small, a little short. Sorry for excess background noise. But yeah, <clears throat> it is just a bonus Baldi's video. So like, I'm not taking this too seriously. I just wanted to give you guys the context for the first like five or so minutes. Show it off to you a couple times. And then like I said, I don't know if the other code will work. If like I said, it's only for 1.4.1. But we had some fun, and I made a small Baldi's Basics video instead of it being streamed. Because this is the first modern DJ content that is Baldi's Basics that is a video rather than a stream. So let me know if you enjoy that. Let me know if you guys want to see me do more maybe video format of Baldi instead of, you know, me streaming it. But I think streaming it, you know, has its perks too. We'll see. But until next time, if you have enjoyed, do leave a like, comment, subscribe, your hands, appreciate it. Hit the bell to be notified, you know. When I come back from our, another Baldi's Basics classic stream or video, whether that be, you know, later this month, next month, in a couple days, in a couple of weeks, we'll see, we'll see. But, yeah, that's everything for tonight. So, until next time, like I said, already told you to leave a like, comment, subscribe. So, until next time, stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll see you on the flip side. Bye, guys, and let me know if you enjoyed tonight's video. See you on the flip side.